everything. Mix the caption. Big booties only allowed on Tuesday night. No, it's stuff. That one's recorded. What's up, YouTube? This is two guys sitting in front of a rug starring your host, Nathan Valdez, and your co-host. You're supposed to say. Where's Anthony? Where's Anthony? He's not here this week. Uh, where's Elijah? We already know that one. He ain't coming oh. back. Oh. He got his one. Uh, well, I'm Nick, and it's <laughs> the two-man show. The Truman Show? I've never seen that movie, so don't make references to it. Oh, okay. The Two Man Show. Uh, and we're going to do things a little bit different this week. We're going to do, uh, we're going to split this up, I think, into shorter episodes because that's what the people want. Yeah. Even though we don't want it. And it makes a lot more work for us, but that's okay. You know, we're here to work. Uh, this is the good old 710 split. Like in bowling? Oh, bowling. I had no clue what you were talking about. Because you said Splitsville and then you said. Splitting. I didn't say Splitsville. He did. Right? You're going to catch him? I never You're going to catch him, right? And we're going to just put that frame right here, okay? That's on you, Ray. I never once... Anyway. Uh, so we're going to get in the first topic of the week. My favorite topic, as always. The it's most, the... Just say it. Just L say it. of the week with Nathan. Sounds like, dun, dun, dun. Sounds like a ripoff of Sesame Street almost. Um... So January is a little bit of an interesting month when it comes to shoes and releases. Uh, there's nothing really, literally nothing, and it's so sad. Uh, Wait, but is, sorry, is that an every January thing, or is that just specifically this year? Uh, that's usually January. Apparently, I haven't been into okay. this too long, but from what I'm hearing, right, the talks around around the street are that January is pretty boring. So if you want to take vacations from buying shoes and stuff, this is the month to do it. The money feels nice. But there is one pair of shoes, two pairs of shoes coming out this month. Um, I'm only going to talk about one of them because we still have time to talk about the other one because it's coming out later. But this one is the either rose gold or pink. I don't know which colorway they consider them to be. Uh, Clout Air Force One or Clots Air Force One. Is that the picture? We'll see. We'll see. Um, so I'm guessing these... I haven't seen the picture, but I'm guessing these look a lot like the blue ones. But it was right there. No, I didn't look back at it. Remember, I... Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a lot like the blue and black ones. Which, um, if you don't know what those look like, there's a picture of them. No. They go have to go watch the old episode. Yeah, scrap the picture, Ray. No picture a lot. No, pi no pictures Go watch our other episode, episode four, where we talk about... Episode six, where we talk about it. Was that episode six? Sure. I don't know. I'm just saying a You figured it out. We're not going to figure it out for you. Um, yeah, they come out January 11th on the Nike sneakers app or on Juice's website. And Juice is a Chinese company, so who knows when they're going to come out, like time-wise, I mean. Yeah? Are you, yeah? What do you think about these shoes? Um... I think they're cool. The collab in general. I've never earned worn Air Force Ones, so, but I've heard a lot of people like them. Well, it makes sense. We're not from Houston. Do people in Houston wear Air Force Ones? I guess. It wasn't it a Houston thing? Like the all black, triple black Air Force Ones? And then yeah. New York was the all white Air Force Ones? Yeah, I don't know. But, um, and then in, in SoCal, they had Vans. SoCal just has flip flops and Vans. I hate it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> No, so what they do with all their collabs is they have this um, outer level that has this nice texture over it, right? Um, but you can peel away the outer level oh, in order to show the level underneath, right. and it's a that's different right. color. The blue one was like the blue and gray, right? The blue one was... It was blue and gray. Like a bluish gray. It like was gray on the blue. top. I don't remember what the bottom was. Had to be gray. And then the black one had red underneath it. And I called it a gimmick. Uh, yes, you did call it a gimmick. Yeah, which, which it is. It is a gimmick. Technically, it is, but they're the only people that do it like that, so it's not really a gimmick. It's more of a uh, design choice. Designer choice, yeah. Um, but those come out, like I said, January 11th. I'm going to go for a pair. They retail for 250 which is kind of unfortunate. So if you want them for personal... Wait, I just realized, 250 250 Normal Air Force ones are like, what, 100 bucks? 110 maybe. Sometimes they're 90 Yeah, so... But to be fair, you're buying like two shoes. Basically. You are buying China. No, you're not buying China. 
you're buying the shoes from well, China. Like, like Chinese plates, like you call it fine China. This is fine China, but just shoes. I don't think the plates originate from China, though. I think it's just the way they're made. Like maybe in the, China, the technique originates in China. I think. Okay, so we've been learning a lot. I mean, I, not that I, no diss on China, but when I think like made in China, I don't think high quality <laughs> yeah, anyway. Yo, no diss on China, but our Chinese overlords, please. Do me some justice and send me some clots, Air Force Ones, please. Rose gold or pink, whichever one you prefer. I don't know what color it is underneath, though. Maybe it's like red. No, they just did red. No way. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if it's like a gold or something. Rose gold? Oh, they did the the Air Jordan 1 mids, too. That had gold underneath, though. Oh, the, the like bone white ones. The, the bone white ones. ones. Yeah, and then yeah. that. Those are cool. Those had uh, gold and the okay. pre-creased ones. <laughs> they weren't called pre-creased. No, they weren't pre-creased. What are you well, they about? looked creased, like from the pictures. You know what I mean? The texture on it. No. Oh. But uh, I guess you know. Uh, but unfortunately, that's it for this week for January. There's other stuff that comes out, but nothing that's worth it and that you guys would know about. To be honest, like, not to sound like an elitist, but okay, all right. Uh, I'll say one thing. Ray's offended. Uh, the Kith Monday Morning Program. Came out today as a rec recording. That is so cool. The Pegasus hoodies. Do you know what I'm talking about at all? Does yeah, this sound like a foreign the, language? The Peggle ones. No nope. Peggle collabs. Nope. Um, and then there's some other. Where you play Peggle? Actually, right? yeah. I think the Shadow One mids come out. The this Shadow. Week. Not that the Hedgehog no nope. ones. The Shadow is the colorway. Um, not yeah. that they're worth like a ton of money, but they come out this week. So. Yeah, Shadow the Hedgehog colored. Or technically when you're watching this the week before this, but, you know, assuming you watch them when they come out, which... Assuming you watch them. According to our analytics, we're kind of starting to blow up, I'm not going to lie. Are we? No, I but... Say, I think we've been a... I think this is the plateau. Plateau. That's what I said. Did I didn't say that, did I? Speaking of toes, we have decided that Red Bull... Is out of here, okay? I mean, they're still here. I'm still gonna keep drinking Red Bulls, but we're we're chasing a new bag now. You want to talk about it? Or is me? it a ten bag season, ten episode limit for each sponsorship chase? <laughs> yeah, we okay. gave Red Bull ten episodes. No, we'll still say hashtag Red Bull sponsors, but you know, we're gonna try. Um, it's 2020. We all have New Year's resolutions, right? Yeah. Now listen, what my, was yours? Uh, I didn't really have one. Oh. But yeah, I didn't a lot that. of people, their resolution is to drink more water. Now, this was just a coincidence. Um, I did want to drink less Red Bull, as bad as that sounds. But I was drinking a lot of them. So, uh, essential water came into my life. Legally, he didn't want to drink less Red Bull. Mm -hmm. Red Bull. Uh, essential water came into my life. And this is the best water I've ever had. Not even joking. The Nile River has nothing on this water. And if you look around my room, which you can't because you're on a, the viewing part of the camera, not on my eyesight, uh, from my perspective, uh, there's like a ton of so essential good. waters laying around. So Essentia doesn't really have like merch and stuff, so we might have to make our own. But Essentia, listen, uh, Essentia sponsors. I couldn't remember that phrase. I've said Red Bull like, for so what long. What were you trying to do? I was choking. I was emotional again. Uh, Essentia, our DMs are open. We have an Instagram now. So Please. If you, you want us to do some, you know, like full body shots with it, maybe? Maybe a little cover-ups? Maybe a little something skinless? You know, a, little, a little skin showing? No. Probably. We won't unless you give us the bag. Yeah. Uh, you could pay us a lot of money. I'll do a lot of stuff for some money. I'm not joking. But <laughs> He's not. Hit our DMs, DMs. <laughs> hit our DMs, hit our DMs out, up, I'm a mess today, and maybe, you know, we can work something out, I like essential water, you guys probably like us, there's no way our, all of our fans know about essential water, like, that was the joke with Red Bull, like, oh, we're the only way to advertise, but come on, Essentia, you're only gonna blow up, I wanna be a part of the team, that's it, that's my, but we should probably tell them our handles on Instagram and Twitter. Of course. So, the Instagram? The cutie guy 69 That's not the Instagram? Don't I don't know who that is. Actually, I don't know who that is. Yeah, <laughs> Please don't, don't go look don't it up and blame up. us if you see something. Don't weird. even... Right here. 
That's our Instagram. Instagram. And our Twitter. And our Twitter. And our YouTube. And our YouTube. But you're already on here, so. You, don't you should be on here. Are we getting illegally streamed to a third-party Chinese website? Vimeo. Ew. Imgur. <laughs> da- what was oh. it? Daily Motion? Ew. No, Daily Motion. Um, please do this on the video. That's a like. That's a like. If I've ever Comment. seen it. Comment. That's a... We- that's Actually, one comment. of my sorry, one of my happiest moments on watch, looking at the tenth episode is people commented. We have, as right now, we have five comments, and it made me so happy. That's five more than the episodes before. Yeah, I mean, I'm one of the comments, but that is true though. He gave it a two out of ten. The episode yeah. rating, I don't know how that works, but uh, we're missing something. Are we missing Ray? Are we missing something? Subscribe. Yeah, hit the subscribe button. Yeah, if you want to, you know, it's just. If I'm looking at this video, the subscribe button's right there. There. So, you know, just go ahead and hit it. It's not Um, that big of a deal. No, it's not. It's over there. It's over there. It's over there. 100%. You know, it's just hanging out. Type amen if you believe in Jesus. (laughs) Scroll past if you don't. (laughs) Subscribe if you love Jesus. Scroll and ignore if you love Satan. Yeah. But anyway, that's going to be it for this. We got to get the Instagram memes. Episode, like I said, we're going to try something out different this week. So catch us in like a day or two or three or whenever we decide to edit these and put them all out. Maybe I'm wearing a different shirt. We do another episode, but not about shoes because we're not going to be that repetitive. Anyway, I've been Nathan. I've been Nick. And this has been The Mouth of Babes, episode 11, part one. To be continued. Sure. 